Cocoa butter, also called theobroma oil, is a pale yellow, edible vegetable fat extracted from the cocoa bean. It is used to make chocolate, as well as some ointments, toiletries, and pharmaceuticals. Cocoa butter has a cocoa flavor and aroma. Its melting point is just below human body temperature. Topic. Extraction and composition Cocoa butter is obtained from whole cocoa beans. For use in chocolate manufacture, the beans are fermented before being dried. The beans are then roasted and separated from their hulls to produce cocoa nibs. About 54-58% of the cocoa nibs is cocoa butter. The cocoa nibs are ground to form cocoa mass, which is liquid at temperatures above the melting point of cocoa butter and is known as cocoa liquor or chocolate liquor. Chocolate liquor is pressed to separate the cocoa butter from the non-fat cocoa solids. Cocoa butter is sometimes deodorized to remove strong or undesirable tastes. Cocoa butter contains a high proportion of saturated fats as well as monounsaturated oleic acid, which typically occurs in each triglyceride. The predominant triglycerides are POS, SOS, POP, where P. Topic: <laughs> Palmitic O. Oleic and S equals stearic acid residues. Cocoa butter, unlike non-fat cocoa solids, contains only traces of caffeine and theobromine. Equals. Topic: Adulterants. Equals. Some food manufacturers substitute less expensive materials such as vegetable oils and fats in place of cocoa butter. Several analytical methods exist for testing for diluted cocoa butter. Adulterated cocoa butter is indicated by its lighter color and its diminished fluorescence upon ultraviolet illumination. Unlike cocoa butter, adulterated fat tends to smear and have a higher non-saponifiable content. Substitutes <inaudible> 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 Cocoa butter is becoming increasingly costly. Substitutes have been designed to use as alternatives. In the United States, 100% cocoa butter must be used for the product to be called chocolate. The EU requires that alternative fats not exceed 5% of the total fat content. Substitutes include coconut, palm, soybean, rapeseed, cottonseed, and illipi oils, and shea butter, mango kernel fat, and a mixture of mango kernel fat and palm oil, and PGPR. Equals. Topic uses. Equals. Cocoa butter is a major ingredient in practically all types of chocolates: white chocolate, milk chocolate, and dark chocolate. This application continues to dominate consumption of cocoa butter. Cocoa butter can be found in most supermarkets, and the process of preparing small amounts of chocolate from cocoa butter and cocoa powder means that the practice of making chocolate at home has become relatively popular. Pharmaceutical companies use cocoa butter's physical properties extensively. As a non-toxic solid at room temperature that melts at body temperature, it is considered an ideal base for medicinal suppositories. Topic. Personal care For a fat melting around body temperature, cocoa has good stability. This quality, coupled with natural antioxidants, prevents rancidity, giving it a storage life of two to five years. The velvety texture, pleasant fragrance and emollient properties of cocoa butter have made it a popular ingredient in products for the skin, such as soaps and lotions. Physical properties Cocoa butter typically has a melting point of around 34 to 38 degrees Celsius 93 to 101 degrees Fahrenheit, so chocolate is solid at room temperature but readily melts once inside the mouth. Cocoa butter displays polymorphism, having different crystalline forms with different melting points. 
Conventionally the assignment of cocoa butter crystalline forms uses the nomenclature of Will and Lutton with forms I, II, III, IV, V and V having melting points 17.3, 23.3, 25.5, 27.5, 33.8 and 36.3 degrees Celsius respectively. The production of chocolate aims to crystallize the chocolate so that the cocoa butter is predominantly in form V, which is the most stable form that can be obtained from melted cocoa butter. Form V either develops in solid cocoa butter after long storage, or is obtained by crystallization from solvents. A uniform form V crystal structure will result in smooth texture, sheen, and snap. This structure is obtained by chocolate tempering. Melting the cocoa butter in chocolate and then allowing it to solidify without tempering leads to the formation of unstable polymorphic forms of cocoa butter. This can easily happen when chocolate bars are allowed to melt in a hot room and leads to the formation of white patches on the surface of the chocolate called fat bloom or chocolate bloom. <laughs> 